The streaming war is seriously heating up with Amazon reportedly committing $6 billion to its video-on-demand service in 2017 in a clear bid to take the fight to Netflix. The financial commitment nearly matches the staggering $8 billion budget Netflix says it will spend on original content this year. Amazon Prime recently launched in Australia and with a lower price point, the company is clearly keen to lure Netflix subscribers onto its service while it continues to build up its library. The $6 billion figure Amazon will spend on content is according to analysts at Wall Street firm J.P. Morgan and is a higher figure than many industry observers had expected, reports Business Insider. By comparison, renowned broadcaster HBO, whose online streaming service is not readily available to Australian consumers, spent $2.6 billion on programming in 2016. In December, Amazon made its video service global by entering 200 countries, roughly a year after Netflix made the move. At the same time Amazon has moved to bulk up its offering of original content including playing a reported $320 million for the Top Gear revival. Last week Amazon Studios boss Roy Price told the audience at an industry conference that the company's focus was on the, the creme de la creme of its blockbuster shows. While the rights and investment can be expensive, Amazon wants to boast the actual shows people are talking about, he said. It's actually efficient and good economics. Amazon Studios has notched a couple symbolic wins against its Netflix rival by whining an Emmy for Transparent and becoming the first streaming service to score a Best Picture nomination at the Oscars for Manchester by the Sea. It was reported this week that the company has also secured a deal with America's National Football League NFL, to stream the weekly Thursday night game. Meanwhile Netflix continues to say it has no plans to move into live sports streaming. The introduction of Amazon in Australia could have some impact on Aussie service stand which holds local licensing rights Amazon Originals Transparent and Mozart in the Jungle. At the same time the streaming video market is becoming more fractured as smaller player move into the market meaning entertainment lovers will increasingly have to pick and choose, or sign up to multiple services. Netflix vs Amazon Prime Video in Australia Australian consumers have the choice of three Netflix plans starting at $8.99 a month for basic Netflix with no HD in one stream at a time ranging to $14.99 a month for Ultra HD content and four simultaneous streams across your devices. The streaming platform is also supported by just about everything, online, iOS, Android, Apple TV, smart TVs and games consoles. Amazon is cheaper and for the first six months cost subscribers just $2.99, for Australian dollars before the monthly fee jumps to the regular price of $5.99, $8. Most smart TVs will support Amazon as well as iOS and Android, but there are no apps for Apple TV or Android TV. Amazon Prime Video is a fair bit cheaper, but for good reason as the library is far smaller than what's on offer from Netflix. And with Stan having rights to a couple of Amazon's flagship shows, Customers in Australia will have to wait a while until they appear on the service. Similar availability problems occurred during Netflix's early days in Australia, but the streaming giant is now believed to have more than 1 million subscribers in the market less than two years after launch. Or launch.